Oh, is he gonna turn full on Sidious now? No. No, 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 no. No, don't let, no. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Ben and today I'll be reacting to The Clone Wars Season 6, Episode 3 and 4. Now in the last episode we had the whole thing with Order 66 kind of going off early in a way with Tup, I guess, killing that one Jedi. And of course he died in the end, which is very sad, but now this has left me confused because you'd think that he'd have to be alive for this story to continue because now we just have the chip that's with, like on Coruscant, with the Jedi kind of aware of it. But now I guess it's just gonna be fun to try and watch Palpatine try and worm his way out of this. It's gonna be quite difficult for him to try and explain away what this is. Yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing what he actually ends up doing to cover his tracks. Yeah, as always, if you do enjoy this video, please remember to like and subscribe as it really does help the channel to grow. And we are on the road now to 900 subscribers and I cannot wait till we reach that. Also, if you do enjoy my content and you wanna help support the channel, I do have a Patreon, the link will be in the description. Over there, I'm uploading these videos and the full reaction a week in advance. So if that's something you're interested in, feel free to check it out. With that said, let's just dive on in. When in doubt, go to the source. Yeah, okay, cool. Tomino and Dr. Nola Say was unable to find the cause of an illness in Clone Trooper Top. Yeah, she wasn't able to find it, but we know what it was. To finding answers for Top's mysterious illness. Yeah, I thought, why are we still on course on? I thought it was going to the Grand uh, Medical Facility. Back with you. And all of the intel gathered sent to the Grand Republic Medical Facility. So then I'll be going to Coruscant as well. You um, were not part of the Chancellor's request. Oh, I thought they were going to turn on him. Were they going to turn on him? I... There is still so much we do not know. Yay, so, not, so still on good terms. Not angry that he sort of broke stuff. The clone had not taken matters into his own hands. There we go, there's the anger. I was trying to save my friend. Perhaps by removing this tumor, it was you who killed him. Don't you dare. You were going to kill him anyway, and dissect him too. Exactly. Specimen and all the data prepared for transit to the Jedi Temple. Tumor and data was to be sent directly to the medical facility on Coruscant. She going against Palpatine? And it will get there. But after the Jedi have run an analysis on it first. Nice. I must personally deliver the tumor to the Chancellor as ordered. Oh, shut it. You test all you want. My word is final. Go on, Shakti. Still not sure if you voted on Ahsoka though, so not sure where I stand with you. You have one more physical to pass. If you are cleared, you will be sent back to the 501st. Okay, so no punishment? Good. It will be good to put this entire incident behind you, Trooper. I agree. Music feels ominous, what's happening? They switch, what are they doing? Are they switching the cases? Did, no, come, who, ah, did they switch the case? I regret that we were unable to heal your friend. Me too. Why are, are they you doing going them? to be reprogrammed as well? No. Going back to the front. That is not what I heard. I heard your mind was going to be wiped. What? Be assigned here and placed on sanitation detail. We can still be friends. Shakti, she lied? After our memories have been erased. Good thing you ran into the droid. Go, CT5555. So are you gonna erase his entire mind? Okay, come on, Arc Trooper. I mean, what do they expect? They are people. He has uh, memories, and that's what makes him him. Why would they think he just willingly erased all that? I cannot believe what you did. Seriously? Let's get out of here. Are we escaping? Yes, go, run, or float, or whatever. Wait, is Why that. Are we here? Is it the real one? Yep. Now let's say switch the cases. Yeah, evil stuff going on. So we are going to continue our research. Yeah, the research. It's doing to get off this planet. I think first course of action, take that thing to the Jedi Council. So go to Coruscant, but still you've got to get off of this whole thing. But yeah, he's an arch trooper, he should be fine. Tell me those things have hyperspace. Okay, you're just walking around, just doing good. Oh, what about that one? Okay, yep, knock him out. Yep, good. Now steal his, like, suit and disguise yourself. Yeah. Oh, Shakti, you are in on it. Sorry, brother. Not gonna steal the suit? Mm. I would have thought that this whole tube stuff was needed. Okay, go, go. Okay, you're out. You're away from Coruscant. Oh, yeah. Away from the, what, the Camino. Have that ship tracked. Yes, ma'am. Shark T, you disappoint me so much. You must have voted for Ahsoka. I don't like you anymore. Autopilot engaged. Navigation and orbit set. Oh, do you know it's being tracked? This is a diversion. 
I need them to chase this pod while we go back and investigate the cause of Tup's death. Okay, so not going to the Jedi. Doing it yourselves. No, oh, please tell me that thing can float or is waterproof. No, okay. Oh, yep. Yeah. <laughs> okay, it's fine. We're going back to figure out why Tup died. I can get us there much faster. Yeah, it can fly. What the, what? You're just full of surprises, aren't you? It just turned. What did it turn into? Various survival modes. I am equipped with. No! It turned into a jet ski. A thank you would have been nice. Okay, that's fun for a medical droid. Lord Tyrannus. Okay, straight back to him. What does this clone know? Nothing as of yet. He's just a soldier after all. I'm still confused on what you know. This behavior is unsettling. First the malfunctioning clone, and now a renegade. You're gonna start blaming them. Those will live up to your design in the end. I am certain. The malfunction to the inhibitor chip is an aberration. Okay, so you're going- so you're motivated by fear here. Afraid the Jedi have inspired creative thinking. That is the cause of this type of divergent behavior. Blaming the Jedi, or maybe you're just a failure. Will this interfere with Protocol 66? No. I am certain of that. Okay, she's afraid. Okay, maybe she isn't as evil as she is. She's- she, does she know- rotten. She thinks he's a Jedi. Would she really be afraid of a Jedi? Must not be discovered by the Jedi. Yes, Lord Tyrannus. I mean, can Dooku threaten her here? Is- like, does he have that power or influence? Because he's meant to come off as a Jedi, a nice person. But she still seems afraid. So I guess she isn't pure evil then. Once we're inside, I need you to get me a change of clothes, AZ. Yep. No, oh, there's so many. I think I saw the Renegade clone head into the storage room. All right, let's check it out. So word hasn't spread that he escaped in a ship? I think he was over there. Okay, nice. And you have a weapon, excellent. We need to get the tumor analyzed. See, if you were smart, you'd put that clone in your original clothes and make everyone think he was the um, Renegade. Have his mind wiped. Don't care about that one. It contains data on the original DNA of every being we have ever cloned. Every being? There's DNA versus that of Django Fett, the original donor. If any tumor like this has been noted before... How many st how much- how many things have you, like, cloned? We know Palpatine has the Zillow Beast in the works. We haven't seen that again yet. Like, what else have you been doing? Really, we've only seen you with the Django Fett clones. Furthermore, it is not even completely organic. Sir? So, uh, Someone implanted it there. There we go! I mean, this isn't an accident. Someone did this to Tup? Precisely. Okay, so they're starting- they're getting clues. They're getting clues. There have been no unauthorized ships leaving Kamino, General. I mean, she knows the clones well. She might figure this out quite quickly. I sense we are looking in the wrong place. Yeah. Someone is accessing the Django Fed genotype. It's them. Evacuate that room quietly. You people should be doing this investigation! Oh, and they are back. Is there another way out of here besides the door we came in? Okay, few he knows. There are emergency access hatches in every major room in case of flooding. Let's get moving. Yes, go. There. Oh no, too late. Ah. Okay, good, go, 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 go. Oh, you welding your shirt. Oh, I love this droid, he's so useful! It's no good, they sealed it from the inside. Station your men at every access point back into the main hallway system. Yes, ma'am. Come on, I have a hope for Shock T. She's a Jedi, so maybe she'll sense that he's doing the right thing? There is still so much we do not know about it. For example, at what stage was it introduced to Clone Top? Yes, are they, are they not questioning that it could be in others? I believe this is an organic chip built out of cells. But what's it for? I do uh -huh. not know. Okay, they're actually getting quite close to the truth. Are they actually going to find out what it does? I need to find out if what was in Tup's head is in mine. Yeah. And, and but it was missed in Tup, and it could have been missed in me too. You have to take it out. Okay, you want to take it out? That how will we? If we haven't seen that before, what happens if they take it out? Well, we saw. Yeah, they took it out of Tup, and he died. Because does that? Oh, that could be bad. That would be pretty good on Palpatine's part. If anyone, if any, any clone tried to remove the chip, it kills them. That'd be a good failsafe. He died after I removed the chip. Maybe it is connected. Yeah. You may die too. That would be a very good fail safe. It's a chance I have to take. Mm, um. I trust you. Aww. It's a good thing these giant hallways are empty. There's gonna be people in there, aren't there? 
And empty again, yay! Lovely lifeless Camino. This will not hurt a bit. Ah. ah. Is that sedative? You do know what you're doing, right? Just numbing. Is he gonna do it while he's conscious? Conscious? You will only be unconscious for a few minutes. Oh no, so good. Put him out, put him out, put him out. I don't want to see this. Why are you going for the eye? Okay. That was just terrifying. Escape was never their intention. They're investigating, searching. Their appearance in the genetics labs proves this. I don't like how smart Shark T is. You're on the wrong side right now. Stop thinking about what's actually happening. Oh, you shaved his entire head. You could have just shaved a small bit. Well, was it? Was it there? Yes. Oh. Identical in structure. However, it appears that the one I found in your friend had malfunctioned. Okay. Yours is perfectly intact. Okay. Wait, and he's alive. So that means they can be removed? Isolated. There is no way of knowing that. And now that we have removed your chip, we do not know what will happen to you. Yes, study him. Find out what could happen. What could happen if they remove the chip? I could snap too. I imagine I'm having to repair like so many fail safes in that. I am afraid you may die as well. Monitor him closely. My analysis suggests implantation took place at the earliest stage of development. Okay, so... And we have to start there. Come on, just assume it's in every one of you. It's kind of a coincidence that the two that you know, you and the other, and Tup, have it in there. You gotta assume everyone has it. This entire room full of children have it. You try to act normal. Normal? The helmet on. How was that? That was not normal. No. For UAZ. Yeah. Really? You <laughs> think that worked? No, that looks great, yeah. No, that's dreadful. Why are you being secretive? Why are you going by yourself? Come on, Shakti, put these pieces together! Okay, so they're right at the we will start base, with the like the stage of development. Okay, so they're here. Come on. Is it in there? Nothing. I will now try a stage three embryo. Okay, so that one didn't have it. Cool. So there's hope. There it is. Ah, great. Try another. You got to assume it's in all of them. Based on this data, I can calculate how many in this tree are altered. Yeah. All of them. I can't believe it. They all have one. Yeah. And you know, if any of them malfunction, they're gonna end up like tap. Don't move! Oh, you came alone. You're about to do something evil, aren't you? What is it that you think I have done? How do you explain this? She gonna confess? Structural inhibitor chip, you... which is supposed to prevent you from being aggressive, like your source, Django uh, Fett. What? Aggre I'm not aggressive? That's dumb. Clone's always aggressive. Have you met Wolf? The Jedi had this done to us? No, Tyrannus did it. Up until this point, there has never been a problem. Well, you oh, this actually explains it well. This explains now. it well. Don't move! It's meant to stop hostility. As soon as it malfunctioned, Tub became hostile. The Jedi instructed that inhibitor chips be implanted in us at birth, but Tup's malfunctioned. Where is the evidence? I have it right here. Okay, good. Indicating a malfunction of some sort. What caused the malfunction? Yeah. Tup's chip malfunctioned, and it drove him insane. These chips have to be removed. Otherwise, the entire Republic Army could be compromised. Okay, and you need to prove that you're not hostile. Besides, when you removed Trooper Tup's chip, he died. Well, that's not gonna happen to the rest of us. And how do you know that? Because he's still standing. Here is Clone Trooper 5's chip. As you can yeah. see, there is no sign of malfunction in either him or the chip. But wait, Shakti knows that the, the Jedi are meant to put it in. Maybe she can question the council. I am not a piece of hardware. I'm a living being. You were created yes. in our laboratories. You are Kaminoan property. So please, I honestly wouldn't blame you if you shoot her in the head. That does not change the fact that he is a danger and must be terminated. No, he's not a danger. It's for me to decide. Fives. Okay, come on, redeem yourself. I think it's time you told your story to the Chancellor. No, not him. Ada, the tumor and fives along with it. Then okay. I am going with you. As you wish, Doctor. You should have now go to the council first. This dog went badly. Why does he need a stretcher? Thank you for believing in me, General. It is not a matter of belief, Fives. Just be kind. It's simply the right thing to do. Okay, hope for you. Yeah, you were still very intent on just trying to brain, like, mind wipe him or whatever it was. That wasn't, that wasn't the right thing to do. <laughs> 
So you're happy now, you're just gonna trust that they're gonna get you the cars on and not try and like mess with your head again? Okay, that's a lot of trust. Okay, I need that continued fast. I'm honestly quite shocked at how well that explains things. Like Palpatine really has thought that through. The, if, yeah, if his chips ever actually malfunctioned, it would only mean that the clones would go after the Jedi, making them look more hostile. And it would back up, I guess, the Django connection. So no one would question what the whole order thing was. But you'd almost, the only clue they have is that Tup kept saying that it was an order. He was ordered, he has to follow orders. That's a program into him, it's not hostile. But I don't, they're not gonna see that, are they? But I do love how close they're coming to the truth. Cause like, we know it can never be fully told cause we know that what, what happens with Avenger the Sith. Order 66 happens, everyone's caught by surprise, everyone dies. So, oh no, oh great, Fighter's gonna kick the bucket, isn't he? Are they really gonna kill the last member of the Domino Squad like this? Cause he's got the chip out, he basically knows what's happening. Now he doesn't know fully, I guess he would have to believe um, the Nala Se's story about it, saying that it creates hostility. He doesn't know the full extent of it, how it's designed to kill Jedi. So, I, I, there's hope for him, but it seems like if he knows this much already, I feel like he's gonna die. Shark T is just very frustrating to me. I mean, that's the same with all the Jedi Council at this point. She probably voted for Ahsoka to be kicked out, so not the biggest fan of her right now, because we still don't know who actually did that voting. But like, she ha she knows the clones. The, the thought that she would manipulate him, or at least lie or withhold the truth, so that he would basically be mind wiped. That is very annoying to me. That's, deci that's deceitful and mean and awful and dark. That's basically as close as you can get to killing someone, because you're erasing who they are, their entire personality. They're basically a new person after that. So the fact that she was doing that so nonchalantly is... It's very, it's, you know, it makes me feel a lot less of her. But glad that in the end, she's sort of seeing the evidence. I mean, she should have been doing this investigation from the start, but like, I hope for, uh, the ending went less off. They need to get those chips to the Jedi Council now so they can actually sense what they are. Maybe they can sense the danger and the darkness behind them. But taking him, taking fives to Palpatine is like the worst thing she can do. And I have no idea what's gonna happen there. Cause Palpatine, he's gonna wanna kill this guy immediately. He's gonna order his execution just saying by the fact that he's gotten rid of his chip and they can't take the risk. That is just the, uh, it's just, it's not, I know it's gonna end badly. I hope Fives lives. I hope he finds a way to escape all this because it is being brought into the belly of the beast now. So he needs to get off Coruscant of all places and somehow, I guess, escape with this information. But it, it does not look good. Popular belief isn't always the correct one. Very like that one, but how does that affect, how's that gonna affect Fives and Palpatine and Shakti? After the mysterious death of his friend Tom, Arc Trooper Fives embarked on an investigation. So how come Fives died after it was removed then? Because like, Fives didn't die, so why did Fives, why did Tups die? The Kaminoan scientist Nala Se claims the chip is harmless and is meant to restrain the clones from violent, unpredictable action. And that's what she firmly believes, and she's being lied to by Dooku. To allow him to plead his case directly to Supreme Chancellor Palpatine. Bad move. Please be advised we have arrived at Coruscant and will be touching down at our destination shortly. Have they restrained him? Oh, he's not hostile. This is why you should not have gone on that table. She's gonna try and kill him. Don't you dare. Okay, no, she is evil. Wait. Uh, yeah, oh! No. Is that the death thing? What did you do? You drugged me. Only the drug? Why would she do the death thing? Why was she acting suspicious if it's just a jug then? What is that? What is that meant to do? Uh, mission. No, uh, what? Easy three. Oh great, you're spanting nonsense. And of course it's super dark and ominous. How did the Jedi not think that he's evil right now? Look at the place he's like surrounds himself in. Dark tea. It is good to see you again. Is this Vader's room? Is this where he built Vader? So this is the clone who has caused so much alarm? I don't like he still comes off as kind. Just alarm, not trouble, alarm. Sir. Calm. God. There we go. him down, please. Calm. He's calm. See, not hostile at all. The chips, Chancellor. Chips. These were removed from both clone troopers. Yeah, I've got to act like you don't know it. Those are inhibitor chips, which are placed in clones to make them less aggressive. He's got to play so dumb right now. Explain to this clone that they are placed in them for his own good but he removed his chip nonetheless. You're still not taking accountability that you couldn't figure out that was the issue to begin with. And we're positive this has nothing to do with the virus? Yes, positive. No, 
We still do not know for sure what caused Trooper Tup to kill. Kinda true. This clone has removed his own chip, which makes him a risk to himself. Oh, come on. Listen to what she's trying to do. If it's not them, then it's a separatist plot. They use this chip against us to make us more violent than less. Yes. That's why Tup killed General Tipler. A separatist oh. plot from before the war even started? Oh, he why? Oh. Unlikely. He's trying to plant as much doubt. It seems very unlikely. It is absolutely impossible. It's literally the right answer. Perhaps it would be best if Clone Trooper Fives and I discussed this without your presence. No. I want this soldier to feel he is having a fair say in this matter. I hate this, he's playing the game so well. This looks so good. Behind closed doors, no one has to just kill him. And he can say whatever he wants. Where were we? Oh, is he gonna turn full on Sidious now? Is he actually gonna go full reveal himself to fives? No, let me go. Right, right, what's happening? What's he trying to stage? All of this is gonna be fake. Bang. Oh no! Come no. on, dear. What did you reveal? What did you say? It was so sudden. It was not sudden. Don't run! Come on, no, you can't. Just listen. Just say he's a Sith or whatever. What did you learn? He must have gone mad without his chip. No. I trust you will keep these safe. Of course, Chancellor. <laughs> oh, I hate this. Stop running! Stop running! Just explain to Shakti. What did he say to you? What did he reveal? What did he say? This looks so bad, don't run! Okay, good, jump. I need you two to get to each other. This doesn't look good, this looks more violent. He's not thinking, ah! Close the blast doors! Oh, great. Oh, come on. He's gonna get through. Yep, and you've locked yourself out. What did he reveal? I can't believe Fives would try to assassinate the Chancellor. Don't believe it, Anakin. You're good with people. Arc Trooper Fives feels he is the victim of a plot, separatist or otherwise. And you're gonna think it's a virus. Jedi involvement has not been requested. That's a little odd, isn't it? Yeah, that's interesting. Is that just trying to keep them from knowing about the whole chip thing? Investigate quietly undercover. We must make sure this clone is not killed. Yes! Fives was part of the 501st. If Rex and I find him, he'll trust us. Correct. Since he removed his inhibitor chip, do you dare? Fives may no longer be the man you once knew. He's better. He isn't free. I'm surprised that Shakti didn't even say like, "Oh, do you know about the chips? Like, did the Jedi order it? How has that not been a thing yet? Everyone's saying that the Jedi ordered it, but none of them did. Dooku did it. They wouldn't know. I mean, they're just happy they have an army, aren't they? So are they going to question the fact that they, the ones that like, no, the chip was a separate thing. They knew that the clones came out of nowhere. Oh no, sifo ordered the clones. That's what they knew. Are they just going to say sifo also ordered the chips? Is that what's going to help back this up? Oh, you're a clone, huh? Look, just shut up and drive. Okay. Yeah, it still seems hostile. He's not thinking enough. He's not. He's just trying to... Ah, uh, oh, you need to be so careful. So, heading out for a little fun on a town, eh? I didn't know clones could have fun. There's a lot you don't know about clones. Just be nice, be nice. You ever hear the one about the people engineered to kill? Engineered to kill their best friends, their leaders, and they don't even know it? Whoa, what did Papa Dean reveal? Stories like that all the time. <laughs> okay, yeah, not shocking for that guy. Just, 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 what did you reveal? We still don't know what Papa Dean said. Did he actually reveal everything? He had that evil smile. Did he actually say, oh, I'm a Sith Lord. Oh, I've designed you to kill all the Jedi when the time comes. And because, yeah, that's all he has to say. Then, of course, Fives would lash out. Then other clones would have heard that. Are they, or, uh, would they be under Order 66 control already? Corporal, that's a nice hat you got there. Mind if I see it? Oh, uh, sure, yeah. Uh, are you gonna disguise yourself again? I think it's time for another round. Hey, bartender! Are you trying to just use a hat as a disguise? That is not a good disguise. You have a officer's hat with the clone uniform. Mm, you stand out more. What are you looking for? Kicks, Jesse. Ah! See, Five just needs to no, need, yeah, Five just needs to tell as many people as he can about what he Palpatine told him. He needs to tell at least someone. The more he keeps it quiet, the easier it's gonna be to get him destroyed. Oh yeah, we just got back from Ringo Vinda. 
The strangest thing happened out there. Not gonna recognize him. I know. Yeah, talk, 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 quick. They say you tried to assassinate the Chancellor and that you're infected with that virus that- No, there's no virus. He said I'm being framed. All of us, even the Jedi, are in grave danger. How much does he know? W what can I do, Fives? How can I help? I need to talk to Rex. Or, or General Skywalker. They're looking for you. Just, just turn yourself in. No, no, I'll never get to them. Good point. What I'm mixed up in, it goes all the way to the top. Say it. Here are the coordinates. Just make sure he meets me there. Oh, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Good luck, Fives. Okay, yeah, you'll be fine. I can trust you. I haven't seen it. All right, go along. Come on, get out of here. It's gonna go badly. Defecation, please. You didn't? You walked out? Something that's gonna happen out here, isn't it? No? You're actually gonna get away? Just go quickly, please. Really? That was relatively easy. Wow. Okay. No! Oh, uh, of course something has to happen. Make me believe it. he got away nice and easily. Nope. Gets followed. So where did you go? And why don't you just say what Palpatine told you already? What? 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 Oh, great. What's happening? Is this the drug that Nalose gave you? If it looks like he's dying, they might blame on the removal of the chip. I need to know if it's either the drug or the chip. No! You need to patch that up. You need to hide the five. And now that thing knows where you are and it's going to send everyone. Sir, the fugitive clone has been spotted by one of our probes in sector I-9. He's a very risky game right now. He actually told- did, If he actually told someone what's actually happening, that's insane. Cause like, Virus has escaped. He could easily tell other people. Is that a kid right here? And Rex? What's gonna happen? These are the coordinates Kix gave us. Let's hope Fives is inside. Uh, I hope he knows what he's doing. What did Palpatine say? No, put that thing away. Come on out. Just want to talk to you. Come on, be friendly. Everything's good. Everything's good. Just be chill. Please, sir. Please. I'm on up. Okay. All right. I'm putting my pistols down. Come on, good terms, good terms, good terms. He doesn't have weapons, you're all fine. I need your help. I know you do. We know you're not well. Just get on with it! I'm not crazy! Please. You sure sound dead. What are you doing? We're here to help you, Fives. Just come with us. Let us take you back to the temple. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? No! Oh, this looks so bad! I was framed because I know the truth. How much of the truth? It's about a plot. A massive deception. Yeah? Well, there's a sinister plot in the works against the Jedi. I have proof of it. By who? That everything that I know is true beyond a shadow of a doubt. Yes, great. Just say it. In here, it's it, it's in here, it's in all of us, every clone. What is it? Oh come on. Organic chips built into our genetic code to make us do whatever someone wants. Okay. They even kill the Jedi. It's all in here. Come on, Anakin actually knows this. I knew. It'll be okay, Fives. We'll sort this out. Uh, you don't believe me! No, ah! Uh, why did you say Palpatine told you? Why? Closing in on the target. Everyone get ready. This might be hard to believe, but it's this a striking thing. How do I know? It won't be a trap. The Chancellor would try to kill me. Yes. Now I promise you that. The Chancellor. Sith Lord, say it. And he's actually intrigued by the Chancellor name. I don't know to what extent, but I know he orchestrated much of this. How much do you reveal? He told you. When you tried to assassinate him? No! Mm. Too far, Fives. The uh, Chancellor is incapable of what you claim. Oh, great, no, Anakin has gone too far. This is too far. No idea. Stand down, soldier. Stand down! No, no, no! Stay back! Don't do it! Don't do it! No! Get away from me! Oh, I don't like this. I don't like seeing Fives like this. <sighs> no. No, 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 no. No, don't let. No! Don't let Fives go out like this! Fives! Fives! Come on, no, no, don't be lethal, don't be lethal. Fives. Brother. 
Oh, no, 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 no. <sighs> Rex. Fives. Come on, pass it on. Let Rex. It's bigger than any of us, than anything I could have imagined. Why couldn't you just spit the stuff out? Oh, I never meant to. Don't die, don't die. I only wanted to do my duty. Oh. <sighs> Okay, Rex, come on, please believe him, please. Boss. No! Stay with me, boss. Come on, do not let the last Domino Squad member die like this! Nightmares. They're finally over. No! Boss. Oh, boss. Why? Don't go, stay with me, stay with me. Boss. Boss. Don't go. Why do they just keep throwing in sad arcs? Where's the team? Then Ahsoka's arc and now fives? That came so close. Oh, it's just, it hurts more that Anakin's now that far into basically in his view of Palpatine. It's gone too far. Have we discovered any new evidence? I've had my own personal doctors examine both bodies. No. Ms. Nala say did miss something in her examination. I'm gonna say a virus. A parasite. Oh, there we go. Probably in a canteen of water they both share. It did cause the inhibitors to decay. It didn't decay fives. We have prepared an inoculation for every clone trooper in our army. That's just a placebo. There's nothing wrong with them. It's a placebo. It's over then. Yes. Check the thing. We must direct our attention back to the war at hand. Each day we grow closer and closer to victory. Oh, I hate this. He's so close to Sidious and they were just right there and there. You are just blind. And even Anakin, why? Have you received the inhibitor chip that you requested? I have indeed. Done well, Doctor. It's shocking. All they have to do is put a head up and they're just completely disguised. The bone in question is now dead and the Jedi still suspect nothing. You did this so well. Destroy all evidence. Great. They actually managed to reveal the chips and the Jedi are none the wiser. To stop our plan to execute Order 66. Yeah, she said the line well. <laughs> Great. And it just ends. The writers of this show certainly have some like sick sense of humor. Like what was the point of this art just to make me feel bad? Like, we knew Order 66 was her coming, there was no stopping it. So why even have this to begin with? Why let you? Why let them get so close to discovering it, only for them to kill Fives and the last of the Domino Squad? I, I, I've already missing so much, I'm just emotional right now, because they just killed him. I would have wanted to, like, if Fives was going to die, at least let him die in battle, he's a soldier. The fact that he was killed by other clones and considered crazy, and now his memory's going to go down as a crazy clone, that's just awful. So now the entire Domino Squad is dead, and... It's just hopeless. Everything is going to go f d dreadful. Now, the last of the arcs have been just really amazing. You had Maul's stuff with Satine, which made me feel so sad. Then you also had Palpatine's awesome fight scene. Then Ahsoka's arc, which is so sad and like beautiful. Now, this one is just sad and frustrating and makes me angry. It's just incredible how they're able to do all this. And now, of course, the Jedi fully believe that those chips' intended purpose was to just keep them unhostile. So that, so what did, um, yeah. I almost, what Nala say, she injected Fives with something at the start of the episode. I'm guessing that was must have been a drug that would kill him eventually. Maybe not a, super fast, but it would at least make it seem like the removal of the chip would kill him, plus it would make him more hostile. I'm guessing that's what she had to do, because he seemed weaker by the end and it made him more crazy. So yeah, okay, no, I fully blame her, she is the worst, I hear. Even if she was motivated through fear of failure from whatever Dooku's wrath would have been, I still hate her, she's evil. I've got to know, what happens after, what happens after the Empire with Coruscant? What do, what do they do to them? I, I almost want bad things to happen to them after everything they've done. Well, those two episodes were certainly frustrating. It's just, like, why does it, is, they came so close. I don't get, what was the point of this arc? Because we know Order 66 was going to happen, there was no stopping it. And it just feels like the only purpose for it was to kill off Fives to, and I guess, make you think that maybe someone will find out what's actually happening. And maybe there is some kind of glimmer of hope that some can survive. But no, they just destroy it all. It's, they like made four whole episodes to demonstrate the inevitability and unescapable nature of Order 66. I guess what they did do is just make the Order itself seem that much more deadly and, I guess, threatening. While also, they explained what's going on with the clones and how they all turned, because for the longest time I thought they were sort of, I thought they just turned and were evil and they would just obey Palpatine no matter what. 
this show really went to show how individual they are and gave them so much more purpose. So it made them seem very odd that they were just willingly turning against the Jedi like so quickly. Now, someone did explain to me a while ago that basically they do have chips in their head and that's what sort of it does. And this did, I guess, give more info on how that all works. So the chip, they're, they're being lied to. The chip doesn't make them less hostile. It doesn't have this purpose that they think it has. Like, why would you want a less hostile soldier in a war? That makes no sense. But of course, they're all believing it because they're all stupid. Like, its purpose, Five said at the end, it was to obey any order. That is... In so, what is it? Is it mind control? Like, what? how does it do it? Does it... I need to... Uh, I need... It almost... They gave hints of what it, like, can do. We know that the chip's purpose is to make them do it. But, uh, like, how? In my mind right now, I'm either thinking it must be some sort of mind control where they just have no option but to obey and, like, they're basically puppeted around. Or maybe it's, like, some echoey voice in their head because, like... It's a chip in the head, so maybe it's directed to their audio or whatever, and it just repeats the order over and over and over again, so they have to do it, because they mention stuff about the nightmare, about the nightmare ending. Don't know what that is, but maybe it's got something to do with the chip. Maybe it's just PTSD from the whole war. Like, I feel like there's so many loose ends that need to be picked up now. I honestly don't think the Jedi could get any lower after the whole Ahsoka arc, but here they have proved me wrong. Shaq T just seemed... I want to say evil in a way, the way she was basically just sent... Fives off to have his mind erased. That was just awful. And I think that's honestly a worse punishment than death because you're just basically turning someone, you're erasing someone, you're basically killing them and then forcing them to live a life that they don't even know and creating a new person. That is just incredibly awful. And then you have her not even like discussing everything that's happened with the Jedi Council and just her going after Fives instead of trying to help him. Everything is just the worst. And then of course, Anakin, who normally he's the good one. Here, it was, we just saw him jump to Palpatine's defense, and it's so painful to watch. Like, I'm so, it, I think this episode, its point was to show where Anakin is so far. I think if he was told this near the start of the war, he might have been more willing to, I guess, think negatively of Palpatine, but here, he's gone too far. It's too far now to go back. He, for, he thinks where Palpatine, he thinks he's perfect. He think yeah. He's got his opinion of Palpatine made, and there is no changing it at this point. Here is definitely where he becomes lost, and this is where it all, I guess, kicks off now. This is the first arc of Season 6. This is where it all goes to Order 66. Now, I definitely want more information on what Palpatine actually revealed to Fives. Like, did he reveal the whole thing? Because he's because Fives said that Palpatine was involved. He didn't. He said he orchestrated a lot of it, but it seemed like he did, Palpatine maybe didn't mention the whole Sith thing. I think that must have been irrelevant to Fives. That wouldn't really matter. I, and if anything, that would probably help if he like alluded some stuff, because that would just make him more confused and neurotic. Like, what's going on? How come I don't understand this? Things are happening. Because if he didn't understand the whole Sith nature of it, he would just think, for, for some random reason, the nice kind Chancellor is trying to kill all the Jedi. What's up with that? And it would make him more angry and more irrational, which would then, the Jug would only enhance that and his weakness and whatever. Palpatine is just such a mastermind, and it's so... It's incredible to watch him work, but it's so painful to see the effects of it. That ending as well just hurts as, well, as much as everything else in this episode. The fact that Fives, the last of the Domino Squad member, died the way he did is just not right. Echo died in the explosion. Um, I'm gonna fit Droid Bait, he got killed by the... What, who was, it was the Commando Droids on the moon thing. And then Heavy sacrificed himself, that was an amazing death. Then there was another one who I'm forgetting the name of. He, I think, died with the giant worms on the moon. And then to see Fives go up like this, it's just... He doesn't deserve that kind of death. To die with everyone thinking he's crazy. With him, with everyone thinking he's lost his mind. And this whole... This deceit and lying. I, w I wish he almost died in battle. But he got killed by other clones. And it's just... It's not right. I think at least the only comfort I can get from this is that Fives, at the very least was sort of broke out of Order 66. That was not going to work on him. So maybe that means there is hope. Like, what do we know? We don't, we, yeah, we don't really know what Nala Singh injected him with. Either, there's two options right now. Either that was the drug that was going to kill him and that it just took a long time to take effect. Or the removal of the chip actually does kill them, which would track with what happened with Tubbs because we don't really know what happened with him. It just malfunctioned on its own and then he died upon its removal. But then it was a tumour, so I don't know. Maybe the malfunction caused his death, whereas Fives had a clean removal, so maybe that meant that he could live, and then Nala Singh's interference with the injection is what killed him. 
or the removal of it killed him. I just want to know, if they can remove the chip, does that free clones? Because, like, there's... Uh, who, what clones are left that I'd want to live? I guess, is it just Rex that left? I guess you have the wolf pack, but we don't really know them that well. Rex is the main one that I would want to live now, because he still has the chip in his head then. I don't need to know if that, like, the removal of it can save some of them. And also just analysing Palpatine a bit, it's clear that he's getting more comfortable and ready to, I guess, start revealing himself, because he's revealed it to fives now, and it feels like he's been getting more confident in his, who he is. He went to Mandalore and just completely went full Sidious there, and I guess that smile at the end where he was basically in the same room as the Jedi and almost revealing, he was being Sidious at that, that point. So it's very clear that he's getting more confident and he's just growing, I guess, stronger I guess, in his plan. Yeah, I think it's just a sign that things are about to come to an end. This is the start of the end, if you will. This is where the Clone Wars begins to go into Revenge of the Sith, and then everything just kicks off and gets, and the Empire comes in. And then I think lastly, just looking at the techniques and the writing of this episode, they were very well done. I mean, the the whole purpose of this was to make you, like, make the audience feel tense and on edge, and they did that so well with, like, how Fires became erratic and he couldn't get the things that he wanted to say out. It was annoying, but it was, it backed up because of what Nala Singh's interference. He couldn't get the words out. And that was just done so well. And I, it was just so frustrating, and the thing, the, how they make you feel in this show is just incredible. Yeah, with that said, that does bring us to the end of today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed, and hopefully next time we'll have something a little lighter. We've had three arcs back to back now that have been very depressing, so hoping we get something with a glimmer of hope soon. Because I know the next arc is three episodes, and I'm basically going to do one video on that because Clone Wars is an annoying... It's, had, it's, had, it's got an odd number of episodes, and I want to make sure like season seven is all two episodes per video. So getting all the three episode arc out the way, next episode, which is episodes, season six, episode, I've got it down here, five, six, and seven. So all of those will be next time. Hopefully it's just a little lighter. Yeah, I will see you then.